Today we'll be looking at a brocade red BMW E34 540. And that's a look around our BMW E34 in Brocade Red. If you did like this video, be sure to like and subscribe to our channel so you never miss one of our future videos. But until next time, bye bye. But if you want to know more about this car, I'm going to take my phone off the tripod and have a walk around and get into some of the nitty gritty stuff. So if that would suit you, carry on watching. The third thing you'll spot is probably the colour. It is brocade red, it's general genuine brocade red car from factory. Over part of the sports interior from factory. These were the main reasons we went for this car. The interior is It had been standing in a field since 2001 slash 2002 and she still managed to shine up quite well. We have pre face lifted the car which means the front lower bumper had been planted in satin black. We have removed the M skirt and painted on satin black and we have painted the rear lower bumper on satin black. There is a few niggles that need sorting out but the car hopefully will have a full respray at the end of the year. We are running the rear 70 inch style 16 in staggered form. These are genuine 17 inch BMW Star 16 wheels, not too much to the 16 inch wheels. These are 10 inch bigger and staggered. She has been off the road since 2001 slash 2002. We brought her September last year and we've been doing bits and pieces to her. Since then, if you can see, there's a bit of a paintwork floor there. Obviously, there is a bit of damage in there. That was not done by us, that was done in storage. Uh, but apart from that, she's quite a tidy effect. The jacket points are good. Number one, number two, and three, number four. The engine is the M60 V40 um, BMW unit V8, one of the first V8, modern V8 BMW made. It's a strong unit. The plastic coverings off it, obviously, we're we'll doing different work to other V8. It's why it's time putting it back on, taking off, pulling back on. And changing it up it to try and track down a fault so it's off it makes all the jobs like coil pack sensors old valves makes all that stuff dead easy to do without giving them to take the plastic trim off every time you need to do something I said the interior is lovely only one slight problem the plastics have gone 
this funny colour I thought that was quite normal but uh, to vanity show last weekend I looked at my friend's um, Oxford Green 540 6 speed manual with part of leather and it was totally different to this so I think this has been hit by the UV loads but everything works is good and that's Erica a resident teddy bear who come with a car she spent ages on the way to park herself and now she's been promoted to the front dashboard also some all quite good The phone screen's been cracked and the roof line's a bit saggy, not a bit. We've got a genuine BMW 850 CSL steering wheel. That's not the bulgy type one, it's an evolution of a big bulgy one, it's the sport type of a big bulgy one. And I love that steering wheel, it's great. We've got an auto dip mirror also. We've got MW. Radio Blanca because we have the levels lovely. That was the old owner's soul session mixed by jazz and groove. The old owner used to have a nightclub before he stored it away. So it died come with a radio, so we brought a BMW Delete panel. That's been an unedited raw view of a BMW E34 in Bracadre. If you did like this video, please subscribe to our channel because there will be a lot more videos about this car and about our black 546 speed, our Cosmos Black 546 speed, which has been fully reached at the moment. So, if you do like Career 34, this is a good channel to subscribe to because we have lots of content. I have a lot of friends with Career 34, so I go to most of the main shows with my E34. Uh, my father's a big E34 fanatic as well, so we're a family of BMW E34 fanatics. So, until next time, bye bye.